morning. <laughs> um, I am trying to decide on something, so I was thinking you guys can help. Okay, so what I'm trying to do is create this pattern for my son who has outgrown the pattern. So this is Simplicity 1169. And I am doing the little boys thing, which is view B, as you can tell. And it is really cute. And what I'm planning on doing is creating a jumper for my son. And I'm going to create a dress with the same material for my daughter. Well, what my plan is to do is to use this pattern, which is new look. 6880. Um, I'm going to use the pants pattern because it's bigger, but I'm going to use the upper portion pattern for um, the bib of the jumpers, and I'm going to lengthen the straps um, by as much as I need to to uh, coincide so that he can have enough room. Now, that's my plan. However, um, when I put the two patterns together, I noticed that there's a, um, a, a width difference uh, within the crotch. And it's concerning me um, because the, other than that, the pattern looks perfectly the same. Even though the um, sizes for the Simplicity 1169 shows to be from 21 to 24 pounds uh, for the weight and 31 to 34 pounds for the height, which I'm not too worried about the height because I can just lengthen it. However, the toddlers are saying that the for the pants uh, for the um, New Look 6880 is showing the uh, height to be 41 inches, which is the length, okay, but the waist to be 21 inches. So uh, if I'm reading this correctly, the 21 inches for the waist, um, when I put it together, the 21 inches for the waist is exactly the same as the 21, as the waist for the Simplicity 1169. And if that's the case, that's going to make my life a lot easier because then I could just follow the directions and just lengthen the uh, the thigh, make the thigh bigger, and, of course, make it longer. Um, but that's what I'm thinking, um, which would be a lot easier because I can use the pants pattern for the Simplicity 1169. Uh, I'm sorry, the pants pattern for the new look 6880 and use the bib pattern, but just make it a little bit wider um, bib for the new, uh, for the Simplicity 1169. So that's my dilemma. And I know I keep looking into the camera. I'm sorry, y'all. I'm new to this blogging. I'm getting ready to pull up. I'm going to put up my, um, my seamstress tag pretty soon so that you guys can get to know who I am. Um, I'm very new to blogging, so uh, so bear with me. I was supposed to put up uh, some uh, videos uh, last month. I never got to it. I was supposed to put up a um, video of my makes. Never got around to it. I got busy with uh, business stuff. And I was also supposed to put up some videos of what I've done so far within the four years, which is not much, but uh, but I never got around to that e either. So I do apologize. I'm a horrible blogger, but I am going to do better. So my December makes should be, I should have like maybe at least four things for my December makes. So that's what I'm hoping to accomplish. I want to make my of course my son his jumpers for Christmas I want to make my daughter a dress for Christmas and they're gonna have the same thing and um, I think I want to do the red dress uh, thing 
and I'm going to do my daughter's dress and my son's pants to be my uh, little red dress project because uh, they're going to be in red. And I'm also going to do a dress for me. It's going to be long sleeves. Um, I stay in Florida, but we're still kind of summer-ish, fall-ish, but not quite fall yet still kind of summer our fall winter don't start until like january or february and it ends in march or april so uh so we don't actually need that many clothes or anything like that i still have my air conditioner on it's hot outside uh but that's my plans for what i'm trying to accomplish right now it's just getting this jumper created um, if y'all have any comments or suggestions, please leave them below, um, letting me know what the best way to uh, get these done. Um, I would really appreciate it. But anyway, thanks for listening to me. Bye.